Today I thought we would pretend like we're at the ocean. How many of you have ever gone to the ocean? I've been to the ocean several times and I have to say that that is my happy place. As you can see, I have a ocean shirt on. Um, I love palm trees. I love everything about the beach. The water, the white waves crashing in, the sand, collecting seashells, and just relaxing. I don't know about you, but I am anxious and ready for days that I can spend outside in the sun and just enjoying nature. So today, I thought we would make a salt painting and do a jellyfish. So here is my, whoops, got to turn it right side up. So here is my finished jellyfish. And we're going to step by step go through what you need to have this part finished piece. So first off, you need to get a card, piece of cardstock or something a little sturdier than um, construction paper so that the water and paint doesn't soak through. You'll need some table salt, some Elmer's glue, and then some fun watercolor paints, and of course water to um, work the paint through. So then what you'll do is you'll take your glue and you'll make your design on your paper. Uh, so the body of the jellyfish, like I showed you, and put glue all through that. And then you'll take the salt and you'll sprinkle the salt onto the, to the glue. Empty any excess salt that you may have. And then the fun part is with the color paint. Pick out what color you want. I'll take this pretty blue. Get it nice and wet. Take your brush over here onto your salt. And just watch the paint bleed into each other. Every once in a while, get your brush wet again and dab it into the paint. Very basic, very easy, simple project. And when you're done, you have this. I look forward to seeing your creations and I hope you have a great day. I'll talk to you later. Bye now.